This is the paper that I worked with three current and former DOHMS authors, Brett Weicker, Catherine Bartley, and Donna Eisenhower. It's very hard to remember and report to your physical activity. In this paper, we introduced how to assess accuracy of self-referred physical activity data and how to adjust for these errors using a regression calibration method. We used the telephone survey data of about 3,000 New York City adults and accelerometer data of a subsample of about 700 survey participants. We calculated the validity coefficient, which is a measure of accuracy and attenuation factors. We also provided a step-by-step -step instruction about the measurement error corrections. The overall validity of self-reported physical activity measure was 0.19. Ranging from 0 to 1, the validity of our survey measure was quite low. The overall attenuation factors was 0.14, indicating that the measurement errors substantially attenuate association between physical activity levels and health outcomes. Participants with higher accelerometer values were more likely to underreport the actual levels. After correcting four measurement errors, we found that association between outcomes and physical activity levels were de attenuated. We found substantial measurement errors in self reported physical activity data. It confirms our common sense, but real contribution of this study is to show the importance of performing a well designed validation study because it allowed for understanding and correcting measurement errors. <laughs>